Alright guys, welcome back to some more Elden Ring. Sword Saint Onion here. Um, last episode we conquered the Shaded Castle. So I thought we'd maybe come down here and check out this and this next. But before we do that, we're going to head to Round Table Hold. Let's see if we can do some upgrading. Greetings, are you here for spirit? Yes, we will definitely do that. So we need Ghost 6 for Lutel. Well, I took you for dinner, no matter it's out your arm. And we need uh, 7. Um, let's bring this up. Yeah, so we got some upgrades in, that's good. Now, we need Somber 7. There's no chance in hell that this sales lady over here has that. Oh, I think Dung Eater's here. We'll have to save Dung Eater for a later time. Yeah, no, we barely got any of the Bell Barons. us go back and do as we planned maybe this cave here and this probably church there church and there's a brand new did you see, did you see that tree in there? look at this it's a brand new herd tree growing little or minor tree almost Jars broken everywhere. Minor Erd Tree Church, there we go. So it is a young Minor Erd Tree. It's, it's gorgeous. Golden Order Seal, awesome. Formless sacred seal depicting the ceremonial observation of order. Enhances gold, golden order fundamentalist incantations. Fundamentalism is scholarship in all but name. Scales incantations using both intelligence and faith. Wow. I really sh I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna use this. It's perfect for us. And once we start upgrading it, it's going to be even better. 
That's really cool. Glad we, uh, bug it. Glad we got that. Golden centipede, nice. Any more? Oh, they're all over. Yes. That's good. Okay, now if we go out into the east, maybe we find this cave. Do some more guards. episodes or last episode I killed a goat and it didn't drop anything it was the first goat I killed probably this whole series maybe didn't drop anything felt so bad Butterfly on a lone grave outside Lane Dell. Now, the smoldering butterflies. So these butterflies relate to Melania. These butterflies relate to St. Trina. These butterflies, we don't really know who they relate to, but the new rumor is that they relate to. Mesmer. And there was an, a Erdtree guardian praying at a grave with a smoldering butterfly. Someone who knows a lot about lore, get on that. Hold on, let me just uh, take a look down here. I actually want to write, I'm going to write this down to be honest. Moon grave, Altus. I'll put a little marker here. Because you know what, I might make a little, I might do a little <coughs> second Elden Ring unsolved. Okay, so <laughs> cave is right here, but it seems we have to go all the way down and around this way. That's what I'm seeing now. But that that grave is interesting. That's very interesting. And it just so happens that my other Elden Ring unsolved uh, episode is about other graves that I'm wondering whose graves they are. So it'll be perfect. We are now in. So, wow, this is interesting. I haven't really taken a look at that before, but look at the, it's, I mean, oh my God. Yeah, Elden Ring has no level variety. Elden Ring has shitty graphics. Yeah, get, get the fuck out of here. Look at, oh my God, it's, do you think From Software is gonna make an ugly game? Dead wrong. Every game they make is beautiful. Okay, I saw this little, Where'd he go? There was one of those scarabs where all you can see is his footprints.
thought he could have swore I saw it. Oh, I hear him. Oh. Oh no. He's got such a long path. It's gonna... Dang it! We are definitely not going to stand here and wait for any of that. So, so, mm -hmm. okay. okay, Blood Rose. That's interesting. There's our cave. Message today. Precious item I had. It's well lit. everywhere in here. Sealed tunnel. Do I rest? I don't know that I need to. Why not though? Okay. Let's move on. Um, I should change this spell. I don't know that I like it. Green glimstone in there. Backpacks. Take us down to these guys here. Let's check them out first. There we go. Very nice. Little item. Oh, I hear, uh, what are these guys called again? There we go, there's a smithing. There's a belt there. Oh! Okay. There's gonna be hidden paths everywhere in here, then, I guess. That kind of gives me anxiety. Guessing that hidden path is the progression route. Unless this wall to our right is also a hidden path. Lots of material. Check the sides here. We just did this in the last caves we took on. We'll drop down there after we send the elevator. I noticed, <laughs> forgot to mention this, but I thought it was hilarious. In some of my previous episodes, while I was taking notes and stuff, oh, I should have dropped down on that thing. I noticed I called elevators ladders, and I just got, I just laughed so much. Boo. And then I got like way ahead of myself, and I was thinking of like down the line, 
if I have like fans and lots of viewers and merchandise and stuff, memes, then like the meme or like the merchandise would be like a meme of some stupid guy referring to a elevator or a ladder as an as a elevator. Like looking at a ladder and thinking like a thought bubble above his head thinking about the opposite of whatever it would, would be. Okay, so I'll kill this guy because he'll probably chase me. But the rest of it, I can probably just yeah run away from the kind of slow. So let's try that again. Oh, but of course, watch. Now we're gonna not be able to get our runes. Fuck. That's annoying. And we're probably gonna die here again. How much runes was it? Should I go back up? Whatever, guys. back up. Now I just have to be able to make it down. Like, I thought I was going to be able to... Did I make it onto this first piece? Or did I just fall straight down? Very cool. Definite Dark Souls 1 vibes with all the roots and hidden paths. And if you know, you know. big enemy if we need to crack that open. What's that going to be? Let's take America. Try jumping. go down what's down there oh I see it did you guys see it it's one of those pieces of shit 
the first one I've killed of those this run. Okay, now I'm a little bit more comfortable dropping down there. Oh, I needed him to break open that statue, though. That's okay. It's probably just crafting materials in there. It's probably a good smithing stone. Rune arc. See, even the heroes that have pieces of the Elden Ring get killed by the abductor virgins. Any hidden paths or anything? Damn. Well, that's alright. Yeah, good job putting your message in front of the elevator, you son of a bitch. See, don't be that person. Don't be that person. I bet that I, I'm get. I guarantee that person did that on purpose as a troll. But that is just so annoying. It's like the toddler who plays Souls games does that. You know what I mean? Like, no, you're not being cute. You're being freaking stupid and annoying. over. Like the finger butthole is way more funny than putting a message in front of a ladder. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wow. That's lucky I didn't get killed by these things. There's clearly one here, right? Yeah. Not today, pal. Okay, we know there's an item up here. over here then. Not die, this is pretty deep into the fucking dungeon. Let me see, monkey do. 
monkey pee pee all over you. <laughs> that was close. Now there better be a stake in front of this boss. Otherwise, is this the boss? Ooh, some architecture. Where are we? And like, you know the miners weren't the ones who built this. Unexplored, okay. Great sword forged from golden hue meteoric ore. The blade conceals gravity ma manipulating magic, a weapon unique to the Onyx Lords, a race of ancients with skin of stone who were said to have risen to life when a meteor struck long ago. Cur Where's this gonna take us? Oh! The Divine Tower. Is there a grace out here that we wanna get? Yeah. All right, let's rest at the grace. Pop a level, end the episode, and uh, we have no reason to go up here yet. So we're just gonna, this is what I do, we'll mark it. We definitely need to come back here after we get, I think, Morgoth's great rune. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll take care of that when we do that, but for now, let's just, uh, in 30, faith 30, vigor 30, and then we'll probably just go to 35 on each. I don't know if we're going to be able to get some arcane going, guys, or not. I think I like the in faith variation of the build. Gotta remember to look at our spells and stuff. Okay, well, thanks for joining me again, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Enjoy the series. I sure am. See you on the next one.